Hello, hello, everybody. What is going on? It is your girl, Antonio MCA here. We are going to do a collective, not a Zodiac collective, and that shit. My apologies in the last fucking video. We're going to do a collective for people who are in currently in relationships and or have been in relationships currently. Now, if you're single, go watch a single read. This is not for you. Do not forget to like this video, comment down below, and do not forget all information will be down in the description about paid personal readings, how you can find me on Facebook, TikTok, and or how you can get a private reading in our session with me. Let's go ahead and cleanse up this energy spirit, please, and thank you. Let's show, let's see here, protect all energy, and let's read. Now, that single read was crazy. It was, it fucking was. But now we're going to do people who are in relationships and are taken. Okay, marry, whatever y'all want to call it, and shit like that. So, let's get started. On this damn read, y'all, let's do it. What do I want to use first? I'm going to use... Well, I'm going to start off with this deck because I did that in the same... In the other reading, but let's start. I know I keep moving the camera to different angles. It's because I really want to try to focus on the cards and less on me. I know what I look like. I know I look good and everything, y'all. Thank you for loving energy and compliments. Because I be seeing some y'all be saying I look good. I appreciate that, you know, respectfully, you know. My man know too. <laughs> Shit. See, what's going on, spirit, guide, angel, ancestors, for the ones who are currently in relationship or have been in relationships with a partner or individual, soulmate, twin flame. Let's see. Y'all, I'm not probably going to be able to sleep tonight without my man. I miss him so damn much. What's going on, spirit? Look, the fucking phoenix. <laughs> It says, new phase rekindled, renew transformation, growth, change mind. I feel like for the ones, like I said, who are in relationships and been in relationships going on one to two years, a few months now, like four to five months. A lot of y'all with this Phoenix card, a new phase is happening in y'all relationship. They could be taking it to the next phase. They could be getting on one knee, you know, even though it's just one card, but still like they, they you're transforming your relationship with this individual. You know what I'm saying? Like. You both are growing and your minds are both changing together. Y'all both on the same page, the same kind of, you know, frequency. Like, shit is looking up for y'all. Like, <laughs> and all them fucking haters. Fucking. Because y'all got haters that don't want y'all to be together, most definitely. Y'all most definitely fucking do. Baby, look, kisses came out. <laughs> they love you, collective. It says unconditional love, giving and receiving, affection, falling in love. And you are in love with this person. This is definitely going to be the one for a lot of y'all. A lot of y'all going to get married to this person in the future. And or as soon as they going to ask you to be their wife and or their husband. Okay? Let's see what else is here. The snake. Mm. And that's what I was talking about. Them fucking people that don't want y'all to be together. Give me a second. I feel like there's something on my glasses and on my fucking face. Competition, enemy, clever, malicious, looking over the shoulder of other woman and or man. I don't know why they didn't put or man. But, you know, it don't really matter. But y'all y'all get the gist of the motherfucking story. I feel like there are people that try to break y'all up and the people that be in their comments and DMs and y'all person is loyal and you're not having it collectively. Like, listen, stop it before shit get worse and or I will have to break a neck because honestly, collective, you not with that shit and neither is your person and your person probably got, you in on your person probably got people coming after you left and right and you're like, why now when I get in a relationship, you want me? Or why now my ex want to try to come back when I already told them I don't want their ass and I want somebody fucking new? <laughs> right right they only want you because they see you doing good that's it they don't really don't want you they just want to fuck your shit up but don't let them don't let them do not let them collective look baby hold up a second hold up what card is this <laughs> i'm not taking on these other cards because i just i don't know why i flip them over it baby a lot of y'all is this fucking close and i mean this close to being engaged with this person <laughs> Hallelujah. <laughs> I told y'all. <laughs> For the ones who don't got a ring in, you're finna get it. And it could be definitely this year. Y'all gonna get that ring. It's this engagement, partnership, commitment, attorney, completion, union. Yeah. They they know you the fucking one. You the bomb. You the shit collective. And they want you. And go Congratulations, y'all. Like, y'all leveled up. Y'all is really like, from all that shit that you have been through with all these ex and all them fucking baby daddy, mama daddy, you really found the one. And they want you. Let's see what else is here, Spirit. The ones who are. Look, I like you. Y'all, and the love card right at the bottom. I was just listening to that song by 
Doja Cat and uh, what's his name? Post Malone. I'm going to put that down in the comments for the ones who don't know that song or really fuck with Doja. I'm a heavy Doja Cat dog. I, I love me some Doja. If you don't know that, now the fuck you do because y'all should. Y'all be seeing my Doja Cat shirt. I know y'all do. <laughs> you know, I love me some Doja. My man call me Doja Mine. <laughs> Someone likes you. Love. Uh, so, uh, someone likes you. Romance is blooming. Fun flirting warning today. Yeah. Most fucking definitely got three. We got one more. I'm going to do like three and three. Look, the Grim Reaper. Y'all, <laughs> I'm so like the twin flame. Like a lot of these old past relationships is over. It's over. You closed out these chapters. Said, listen, the relationship is over. No second chances. Grow and transform your life. And you're not giving your past none of your shit. Like, <laughs> you're not giving them the time of day, no the energy, no fucks, zero fucks, all energy at all. Because you are the totest person. Once you leave me, that's it. I'm not coming back. I'm going to be going to focus on these cards, y'all, unless all my beautiful face. I know I look good and everything, but like I said, it's for my man. Now, let's continue. Let's see what else. We need to know here the love oracle deck because oh baby this shit getting tt -t. this the tt -t -t. this tt -t as fuck this world's fucking t shit okay let's see what else for the people who are collectively in a relationship let me see here my spirit got any ancestors please so like this who are in a relationship and you see not know here let's get in my energy of all What's, what else can we see here? Baby, look, break up. You did. You broke up with your past person. Like I said, this is not what the person you currently with. That's with that past person. You told your past, listen, I'm not breaking up with my new man or my new woman because I want them. I don't need you. And for a lot of y'all, your ex is going to try to come back multiple times they're gonna try to get again because spirit gonna touch you to make sure that you know that this person this new person is your person that past person nada nope i don't give a fuck if they keep calling writing you emails and letters block delete bye walking away and the right ending separation is over and they know it's, it's a wrap for them your ex know it's a wrap but they gonna keep trying regardless shit messy as fuck baby look baby mm. How could I ever be a lie? Why? Why? Like, spirit. Spirit, no, I'm the fucking truth. Y'all see this shit for yourself? Engagement ring, proposal. I don't get this card a lot in my readings. But, baby, when the fuck I do, it's meant to be because there's no way in hell it came coming out twice. And, and, and y'all seeing this shit. And 4K action. And y'all gonna get this ring. Baby, I'm ready. <laughs> Love offer, engagement, agreement, wish come true, baby. You about to get all your wild fucking dreams with whoever this fucking person is to you. So keep it going, collective, because it, it's really happening for y'all. It really fucking is. What else we got to see here, Spirit? Look, faded meeting, and y'all was meant to fucking be. Spirit knew that shit. They knew that shit A1 day one. Like how I told my man when I first met him, it was true love, divine intervention that I met this motherfucker. Like, it literally felt like I was floating on cloud now. Clyde, sorry, cloud nine. And I still to this day fucking feel like that. If it don't feel like your heart is fucking ringing. But what I mean you're ringing, like your heart hurts when that person is not around. You can't sleep. Like I'm starting not to be able to sleep around this month. But like I cannot sleep unless I'm next to this man. That's how much the love is. Like if you can't go a day, can't breathe, can't eat, can't do shit without them. And all you do is ponder about this person. You know you fucking love. That's real love. Love simply allows. It never gives. And this person is allowing you to love them collectively. Like, baby, meant to be destiny, predetermined counter. Y'all were meant to fucking be. Spirit said, this is your person collective. You found the one. You are going to get engaged. You're going to get married. And there are no. This contract with your ex, gone. Broke up. It's over. It's, it's, it's far fucking overdue. Your flowers are being redeemed. Your water it is being fucking, baby, look. And you're going to have a family. <laughs> Ooh, your fucking ex going to hate this shit. It's their own fault. <laughs> they they hate you collective because you told this person, I'm not coming back. And when you told them, you was moved to fuck on. They didn't believe you. But now they see that shit in Okay, actually, you posting up this person, y'all booed up in the court, like, baby, they hate your guts, but fuck them, keep it moving. 
generation children ancestors and origin baby they is fucking happiness hater as fuck baby congratulations collected like you 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 went up as fuck you up as fuck they down and that's you know what i ain't wishing no bad shit on no ex no no past person who fucked me around but you know what karma is a motherfucker you, you know, like, you make your bed, you fucking late in it. You can't do everybody wrong and keep thinking you're going to get good loving when you know damn well you full of shit. Like, come on now. Look, divine intervention, serendipity, cataclysm, supernatural, and karma. And that's what the snake is getting. All these snakes that are trying to break y'all up and trying to do shit to uh, play with your personal emotion. It could be even family. Family might not even want this person with you. But you know what? You telling them, listen, you y'all can kiss my ass. I don't give a damn. I'm old enough to make my own decisions. I'm my own man, my own woman. If you don't fucking like it, well, you don't need to like it. Because I love this person. And they love me. And they good for me. Okay? What else is here? Spirit. Baby, look. Like, spiritual like it is. And that's why you and this person when y'all met it was just it was just meant to be enlightenment epiphany life lesson rebirth and y'all went through y'all life lesson y'all went through that shit i'm so sorry y'all my mama trying to call me i'm not ready mama because i'm in this in this video but y'all learned y'all lesson y'all went through y'all karmic shit y'all went through that shit and y'all handled y'all 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 shit like y'all y'all big girl put your big boy your big boy pennies on and you moved on and now this person hate that shit but you know y'all really in love collective like y'all truly in love I'm gonna go ahead and do some soulmate messages because this really is beautiful like this shit is divine intervention for real like spirit is blessing y'all y'all is blessed collective and it's and it's really beautiful and I'm loving this shit for y'all but give me a second because my mama gonna probably keep calling up my damn phone hopefully she don't interrupt this damn video because I'm not trying to make two separate fucking videos let's see some soulmate messages y'all this is definitely beautiful let's see her I feel at home with you, baby. Oh, shit, collected. They, they, they want this family. If they didn't put a baby in you, they going to in the future because they definitely feel at home with you, collected. But the ones who are in a fucking relationship, I'm trying to tell you, that card hit the floor. I don't take cards that hit the floor. Y'all should already know this. Let me see here. I can't help mention you to my close friends or family members, baby. That's the ones that, that don't that be like damn they always talking about them they telling everybody about you collectively because they can't stop mentioning you they mouth they you you always in their mouth you you are they are mouthful of you like this like man baby you know when you per when your person talking about you because you'll get signs from the universe anytime that diego will be thinking about me or talking about me i hear his name on like a commercial or a tv show out of fucking nowhere like yes Dago is a common name, but when I hear that shit or I see the color blue, like how my nails are random blue out of the blue, I know he's thinking about me. His favorite color blue. So, shit. Thank you for teaching me what real love is and what you did. And that's what they want to propose to you. A lot of y'all collected, they do. Y'all taught them what real love is. Y'all wasn't fake. Y'all wasn't grimy. Y'all gave this person that true shit, and they love you for that. I like sleeping next to you. Oh, shit. You in the bed all laid up, boot up. <laughs> I'm trying to tell y'all collective. They like that warmth. They like that that big boom. Like they they like your shit. They love your energy. They don't like they love. <laughs> Thank you for being so patient with it. And what you were, and they and they love that about you too, collective, because patience is a motherfucker. Because when you fall in love with someone, it takes a lot of time, it takes layers. You know, it, it, it it's like people like onions. They they're gonna make you cry a little bit, but in the end, you're gonna feel so good. In, 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 in good ways, like happy tears. I love our deep conversations. They open up my mind. Oh shit. <laughs> it's truly a fucking blessing collective life. This person, baby, look, whenever I see flowers, I think of you. I'm going to stop with this deck and get onto a new deck and then start wrapping up this reading because I'm not trying to make it too long because I'm going to have to call my mama back before she start calling up my phone again and again and again. I'm going to use this deck and I'm going to get one more bigger deck and that's going to be it, y'all, because... Ooh, every time I get on live or try to do a reading, these cards always keep trying to fucking flip out my goddamn hand. Let's see here. What's else going on, Spirit? For the ones who are currently in a relationship and are involved with the person. Can you please show them what you see? I don't hear. Thank you. I'm going to get for it. Look, past life connection. Some of, sorry, someone with heavy influence from a past life is with you. They watching over this connection, making sure that the both y'all stay humble and low and true to each other and that they're going to keep loving you. You know, like, so. Let me see here. Look, embrace. Find peace where your current state of being at. Find peace in the situation. 
Then we're always gonna be rose gold uh, colors and happiness, but this person love the fuck out of you collective and they gonna keep loving your ass and they gonna keep being with you. Energy activation. It's a connect to the divine, do meditation and prayer, which a lot of y'all need to pray for your person because, you know, they could be going through some things that, you know, they ain't always telling you about, but they love you regardless. You know, my man tell me a lot and I love the fact that he opened up his mouth and tell me how he feel or what's going on with him, good and or bad. Patience. <laughs> manifestations are on the motherfucking way yes they are baby they really are i'm gonna pull one more deck and that's gonna be it because y'all this reading was <laughs> was was clean all throughout the motherfucking read it, it was spitting it was hardcore but you know what spirit said you deserve this shit collected like y'all went through y'all shit y'all healed and now spirit has blessed y'all has blessed y'all with a motherfucking soulmate a twin flame uh you know divine lover whatever y'all want to call this person because this person is yours and there no one else is taking them from you this person is yours okay okay let me see here <sighs> acceptance is the key to inner peace at times you must accept things as they are there's no point trying to change that which is bound to control exactly so don't try to accept what is the more you accept it the more blessings will come in this relationship so don't try to change this person if this person don't want to do something they don't have to but if they are willing to open up their mind and accept things and be open-minded then that's then keep going but don't keep doing shit that you know ain't right for you in the connection walk away if you know that this person is not good for you but obviously this person is good for you because they love the fuck out of you they want to propose collective Look, secret admirers, someone has deeper feelings for you than they are letting on. A lot of these people have a hard time telling you, but they're going to show you in little ways. They'll give little flowers to you and shit and cuddle with you and make it feel good. You know what I'm saying? But that's going to be it, y'all. I don't want to make this video that long. I hope you guys enjoy. Do not forget to like, share, comment, subscribe. Do not forget to stay blessed, stay up on the same YouTube, and I'll see you next time. Goodbye, guys.